uh, win for sure. So that was awesome. So many good players coming out tonight. And you never know who's going to cause the upset. Yeah, I mean, honestly, this should be an exciting one. It's good. I, I'm, as far as I know, Six is still playing Sonic. Um, and oh, then we're yes. going to have Wolf. Mm -hmm. I'd be shocked if 6 WX wasn't using Sonic, because Sonic's still really good in this game. If not, I think a lot better than Smash 4. Yeah, he's still pretty solid. <laughs> hey, maybe we will see that Omega or uh, FD different stage I want to see pick. people <laughs> take more Omegas. Like, Same. I, personally, I always uh, go for either New Donk City or Mori Towers. I mean, Those two yeah, are like my favorites. Why not? Why not utilize all so the stages that we have? We have so have. much good music in this game. We do. I'm that type of player that just likes to go and, and, and change up the stages. You know? Yeah, exactly. Alright, Town and City. Interesting. Haven't played, seen anyone play on Town tonight. Yeah, I feel like this is one of those stages we saw a lot in 4, but we don't see it as often in this game. Mm -hmm. Why do you think that is? Um, honestly, it could just be because of the changes to the Blast Zone that it has in this game, where it used to be you know, the go-to for the small ceiling. Mm -hmm. Now it has that really high up ceiling. Exactly, yeah. So I think it's got a different use now that people just would rather not go for it anymore. <coughs> but we are seeing it on this game one, Wolf versus Sonic 6 WX versus K9. Interesting how we're going to see a Sonic <laughs> against a Wolf. Um, but so far, yeah, both players pretty even right now. Alright, the spin dash into the shield gets the jab, but the gap attack gonna beat out spin dash that time. Jabs, gonna just keep forcing Wolf to the ledge, but the F-Tilt gonna be a great get off me tool. Good Nair uh, from K9 there. Confirms into the dash track right now. Wolf just looking real solid, Perry F-Tilt. <coughs> I6 just trying to get some stage control right now. He gets it. Oh my god, he goes for the spring up here. I was about to say, that shouldn't kill, so... <laughs> but that was yeah, almost pretty killed. close. Yeah, almost killed there. But yeah, bringing it back pretty even still um, right now. I think Kanan actually made a mistake there. It looked like that should have been an up smash coming out from Kanan. I don't think he meant to do up tilt. Don't think that was what he wanted to do. Right, but. fair. Almost killing him off the side right now. Tries to catch him with the longest move in the game. That Sonic forward smash right there. Both players really just trying to take the first stock, but having a really hard time. Both at almost max rage here. Yeah, that's going to do it with the back throw. Back throw. Yeah, he's gone. <clears throat> I dash track gets the late hit, not going to be able to get the kill. Sonic glowing gold right there. Just goes in with the spin dash, tries to forward air him. He's shield not looking so great right now, though. Yep, back here is definitely going to take it at 160%. And that was so clean, you know, we jump backwards, dodge the homing attack, and then still guys landing with the back air. Alright, but K9's, yeah, definitely not out of this. Definitely bringing it right back, even though 6WX took the first stock. K9 brought it right back. Okay, tries double nairing there. Nair just gonna beat out Sonic's approach options right now. Resorts to just going back with the laser, jumps in with the Nair, gets the fair afterwards. XWX gets a Nair of his own, but not gonna be able to find anything else. And K9 with stage control once again. Sick parry from K9. Uh, from that six, was though. a good parry, but he needed. I feel like he needed to follow up with that parry. Uh, a little unfortunate that he couldn't follow up with anything. But both players at the same percent, exact same percent here, 92.5. Um, so this game is as even as it's gonna get. Great narrow catch the landing, yeah. calls out the jump with the upper, goes for another spring Sonic up here, not gonna get it. Not wanting Wolf to land. Right. Up here, no, gets the narrow, goes yeah, for a fair. Yeah, fair. <clears throat> Still pretty strong. That up here, not gonna kill him. Right there, that's the tall blast zone of uh, Tansi coming yeah. in clutch for K9. And we're gonna see K9 uh, searching for, yeah, I was gonna say up smash and those F tilts there, because they're so. Hard to punish, even still, for Wolf <coughs> or for Sonic to catch that with how fast he is. All right, back though, that's definitely going to see out that stock, and we're down to zero a piece. Last stock each on game one here. 
and it's both players back to even one stock each. It's like looking like the beginning of the game all over again. But this is what I'm talking about. All these uh, top tier players coming out and just both just being as good as players as they are, just making it close every time in these sets. So this is awesome. Super hype. K9 actually kind of started to run away with a lead here. You know, up oh, about 50% uh, here. Make it 60. I'm just going to stop with them right now. <laughs> he just keeps adding on. Yeah, K9 definitely being it's looking aggressive. looking real solid, but 6WX gets an up throw into the up air, but Neo just <laughs> does <laughs> it all. And as we've seen from the past from Smash 4, it's always interesting because K9 does level up. If K9's losing or K9's down, he always manages to, you know, bring his rage and utilize it and bring it back. You know, oh, we've always seen reverse 3-0s, 2-0s from K9. So... Always fun to see how K9 performs underneath the pressure. Looks for that forward smash. Doesn't find Ooh. the forward smash from six. Almost connecting. Ah. So close, man. These games. Yep. He's searching for it. Searching for the F tilt. Maybe even F smash and up smash. Actually, real good percentages. patience from K9 there because he w ran up to where six was going to land. And then, you know, just stood there and nearly dodged the back air. Not going to dodge that back air, though. Wow. 6WX clutch, you know, comeback in that last stop. Yep, K9's probably going to be taking off that jacket. <laughs> He's you got to take the training weights <laughs> off, right? <laughs> yeah, feeling hot. He's here to play. And yeah, that was a close set um, for both of these players here. And K9 knows how close that was. So Yeah, I mean, we've definitely seen you know K9 in that situation before. Though. Um, but, you know, game two. Gonna just go right back into it. All right, <clears throat> are they? Yeah, bringing it back to town. Feel like K9 feels like he can definitely bring this back, especially with how close that was. Yeah, I definitely feel like K9 seemed to, you know, get the advantage of the blast zones on this stage a little bit more than 6WX did. So it's not surprising that we see the run back. Oop. Now into the field, just gonna force K9 off stage. Six trying to keep his advantage here, but trading with the forward air. All these dash attacks feel like K9's having a hard time uh, getting c uh, con con conversions right now. Kind of just getting damage and percent yeah, here and there. You know, stray <coughs> hits here and there for him, gets these nares, gets these dash attacks, but he's not really in a position to find anything out. I mean, them. he is playing against Sonic, after all, though. Yeah, that's true, but. You know, I'd still like to see him, you know, getting some more grabs, I think. He's kind of... I haven't really seen too much from him. Mm hmm Definitely. I'm seeing a lot of nares, a lot of dash attacks from K9, a lot of F tilts. Um, but I feel like, yeah, maybe he should utilize the laser a little bit more or be getting these grabs so he can try and maybe uh, mix it up. Ooh, oh, all catches right. the Just star of homing attack right there with the up tilt. that out. <coughs> I feel like one, you know, K9's really great at just pulling the trigger when he <gasps> sees the Able opportunity but speaking flash. of an opportunity right there six wx pulling the trigger on that forward smash you don't got ledge invincibility for that long k9 gotta let uh get gotta up faster get up. than that well all right back to an even uh set game here Ooh. Uh, and into the back here six wx getting some good damage onto k9 and right now he goes out for the Edge guard, but actually just calls out the side beyond stage. <coughs> and we keep that's twice now we saw K9 go for it, and 6 wx was just in a spot to punish it. Starting to run away with this game. Yeah. It's trying to get him off stage too. Um as well. So he can read these get up options and just keep the maintain the neutral on the stage. Right. Which 6WX is definitely doing right now. Harry F2 gets the back here. 6WX only 49%. This is starting to look real bad for K9. Yeah, 6WX is uh, holding on to this stage of doing neutral really well here. And I feel like K9 is just not figuring out what he needs to do against Sonic. Whew. Cheeky going for that F smash. Alright. Nao gets the Ooh. forward smash. Not actually going to get it, but that was... If he had, if that killed that would have been the momentum shift K9 needed, yeah. but you know, 
same thing where that doesn't kill and goes looking real hard. But there he goes. Yeah, he, K9 is not out of this right now. He could woo, definitely bring this back. Watch what you say. That was almost it. <laughs> That's the Nair, not going to kill off the top. Again, the tall blast zone is really just keeping K9 alive. Dash attacks and Nairs. 6WX is making it really hard for K9. Fair. He's with a jump. K9 in danger, but he's not going to die. And the F-Tilt is just going to kill him. All right. Well